Can you guys see the video? Yes, yep. I can. I can see that. So you are scanning. Uh, Not that was scanning, just uh -huh. full body scanning and the same workflow as I did with the other object, just full person. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna just add extra couple words to this. That when you have like a five feet, you put a section. You're waiting until one section is scanned. Mm -hmm. If you have five feet person, you have you're waiting 360 so that's, that's degrees. With the range, right? Three, yes, range. Okay. Of course, everything is range today. Okay. You put cool. 360 frames and you're moving down. Oh, never, never over scanning. Frames. Look at oh, that's a magic, Watch magic the number. number. How precise control that is. Especially the first one when you have face and stuff. Yeah. So then after 360, 350, you are moving on a second section. Another 350, 360, depending on what's Seven, the speed so of you your turntable. It was on a big turntable yeah. scan today. Of course, I miss it here on this area. I should go on the edge. Mm -hmm. I, I see already I miss the under chin. Because and I go too fast down. You don't see it. Look at the indication bar here. Now it use colors to tell you the distance. Like, oh yeah. Or like green, perfect. Yes, orange, here. Not perfect. Red is too far or too near. You need to fix. Now it's more intuitive. And you see now what happening mm -hmm. when you have not checked in the in the beginning, then you have now the floor is captured. Right. Yep. With the turntable, because I'm using the the big turntable. Uh -huh. For scanning this, but that's, that can get easily get fixed because we can you always use. Oh no no no! I have it. I have it. She has a trick. Don't worry. Oh, oh yes, I have it. I prepare everything. So, so I this was around below two minutes. I don't want to go too fast because usually a hundred and twelve hundred frames you need it. So usually below two minutes you can scan the full body. Mm -hmm. Today I have a um, couple of frames extra because I was thinking I'm missing the feet for some reason. Yeah. I like that so, so it now was, you can see the number of frames it's bigger. It's a bigger font. 1,000. Right? Here yeah. you have 1,308 frames. So it's around two minutes. Mm -hmm. Just can take it two minutes. So before you do edit everything, of course, uh -huh. point using. I put a little bit of speed, so you guys don't have to wait it yeah. 10 minutes, see, 8 minutes the, actually. Minimum point distance. Mm -hmm. Now I have a point cloud we can add it. Yep. Yeah, point cloud is ready. Now we have to remove it, what was everything scanned with. Sometimes it don't, but sometimes it do. So it's dependent what you have around. And so I'm removing now. Oh. On a point cloud, oh. everything before meshing, because if you don't, it's gonna waste your time, processing time. Right, so right. quickly remove it. Then you have less points to process. Yeah. Yes, yeah. it's much faster and the most accurate. If you have additional, a lot of additional like this parts, uh, it's yeah. gonna Omri, it's gonna waste it. Sorry to interrupt, CPU. You, Katarina. Uh, Omri, for okay. your question, actually, this model is called. Rebel Point range is built for scanning larger sized object and because of that where you we always try with like for for example tire and people but we did we did have the model called Rebel Point Mini to scan the tiny stuff and focus on like like just you said focus on mechanical okay, things to yeah. show accuracy we do have that yeah, it's just different model used in different applications. Uh, yes, of course, of course, yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's keep Mini going. is my favorite, one of my favorite. Right? Yeah, yeah. And that's I'm using here, sculpture, people. ignore my part because I'm using well, my vacuum synthetic monitor, so I'm using my shortcuts mm -hmm. because I'm on a touch monitor, so I don't have a keyboard, so no I'm problem. using my... Yeah. So it's not belong to the software, my keypad is for my monitor, touch monitor, it's not belong to the software. Got it. So now after you're removing the parts, I keep touching. So after I, I remove the parts, I'm just overlap detection as usual. You know, this is just for showing the workflow. It's nothing special or anything. Mm -hmm. 
just a show, guys, for everyone. The work floor of this. Yep. Few holes, meshing. I put on seven because full body need to be on seven. I mean, it'll work on big things, big automotive things, obviously. Th yeah. This is, this Aubrey, is true. Just, seeing, just if you're curious, I will show you the, oh, look, it's the, ready. the, the automobile we, uh, we showed yeah. with the user scan. We can't get, we can't get an engine in here. Yeah, it's too <laughs> we small. We have limited yeah. space. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I'll, I'll show you something. Yeah, it's, and, it was in a previous. And you can see uh, the guy in South Africa, right? Yeah, yeah. He, yeah, he does the front of his it. truck. You've seen yeah, him the on off road ours. bumper, the engine part, yes. I okay, don't miss the under chin, and now they're haunting me. <laughs> <laughs> right. The under chin haunting my work now. Horrible. I'm sorry about that, but you know that's just for quick. Now yeah. isolation detection. We're gonna see if I catch anything. Oh yeah, I catch look still after measuring. You can still clean a little bit stuff. Yep. It will be perfect if not the under under chin. Oh, so I don't have to scan you today to show the Rebel Scan 5. We can show, we can scan some different things. Yeah. Are you still stick to in front of your favorite? We have an our human, <laughs> so you can oh, scan something popular. else. Right? All right. Yeah. And it's ready. Cool. Cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. That's uh, yeah. That's a full person, full body scan in a breeze. Thank you for showing us that in, in the video. Yeah. That was super educational for me. I really right. appreciate it, Katharina. Yeah, it's not, I, what I learned today is, it's not what, how many turns you scan is better. It's actually, you control the frames. Watching the frames, yeah. 